Hello boys and girls, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about Hasashin's class. This character was released in Korean version last July. And PA surprised everyone by suddenly announcing that Hasashin will be our next new class. We all know this is a very brand new class in Black Desert platform including mobile, PC, or PS4. And in my opinion, this class is specially designed to help new players to rush their level and CP. And this is what makes Assassin's 2 up. Of course, this is part of PA business strategy. They want to lure new players into the game, and they also want to support those new players with this new class. Now please bear in mind that what we are about to see in this content can be different from what will be released later on in the global version because just like what Joel and team said during the live stream, Hasashin will get a lot of balancing and nerfing. This character has already in ascension mode by default. We have to do some quests to unlock some of his skills just like what we do with other classes during ascensions. His main weapon and sub weapon are very specific, we cannot switch it around with other classes. And please don't get distracted by his gear and equipment, this is Korean version. <laughs> So what do I think about Hasashin? Like I said before, this class is very up. His movement is very fast, as if he can blink from one spot to another. He also has the best AOE skills. He can cover wide area, so very excellent for mob farming, which is why class will be very recommended for new players. Hasashin also had lots of immunities and crowd control in his skills. Unfortunately, his ultimate attack is not really effective here and some of his skills also has too long animation which can create vulnerability during PvP. Let's move on with the skills review. And again, remember, global version, there will be some balancing. So expect to see different things later in the global version from what we are about to see here, okay? Now I'm using a translator app to translate the Korean language in the skill descriptions. So some of the skills name can be different, which of course later in the global version, we won't get to see them all.
Okay, so we have seen all of the skills. Now I'm gonna pick four of the skills for PvP and I'm going to troll the arena. And I will use auto attack, which means I will not control my character and let him fight by himself. Let's see what happened. Okay then that's all from me, thank you for watching and see you in the next video, bye bye.